All right, so we are going to film the solar eclipse of 2017. <laughs> Okay, so this is the 2017 solar eclipse, and I'm going to do a skip shot recording, which is recording in segments, and I'll edit it down so you can see the whole thing in a shorter period of time than it actually is. All right, so right behind me, as you can see, is the sun, and it's just about at its full eclipse over here in Pennsylvania, which is probably like 70% or something. Getting closer. Through the lens, through the clouds. Just so you know, I'm filming that through my welding helmet, and that's really the only way you're going to film this thing. It's a beautiful day out.
looks like a crescent moon. But that's not a crescent moon, that's a crescent sun. Oh, man, this kills your arms. That's without the lens. I'm just kind of cupping it a little bit. Very hard to get this without the without a, a lens on it. It's getting closer. That's what it looks like. I just want to make note that I wanted to show you, I don't know if the camera's able to pick this up. It's like a shadow. If the sun is out in full sun right now. See? The eclipse. It's hard to see it. You can't really see it without the lens. But it's sort of like a brownish gray, very light sunshine. It's really strange looking. I don't know if the camera can actually pick this up. And this ain't even a full eclipse yet. This is only the maybe three quarters, something like that. But it's really strange, I mean, it's like the shadows aren't as dark, the, it's like a brownish, but you can't really, you can't really tell. There's my pokeweed bushes, I gotta cut these down before these berries are all coming out. But yeah, it's really ominous. So I'll get the lens back on there. It's strange on here. It looks like it's just starting to touch it. But when I put the lens on, it looks like that. So it's not going to be a full eclipse, but it's going to be like 60, 70% or something like that. So we'll get most of it. All right, I'll update you in a minute. Do a little more, wait a little bit, and I'll do a little more filming.
Okay. So in Pennsylvania, that's about all you're going to get for an eclipse. It's not a total eclipse up here. But this is about as good as you get. And it's pretty cool. It's not full low. Not much to say about it, and there's not really not that much to show other than what you see right now. And I really can't show it to you through the clouds, because you can't really see it. That's what it looks like if you film directly. That's what it looks like. A little blip on the, on the radar. When you put looks the like lens that. on it, it looks like that. So, a little bit more to go. And then we'll upload this video. It's moving quick though. Look, two suns. That was it, basically. It's almost gone. What's this other sun up here? Yeah. That's not it. I don't know if that's a reflection. Or is that in the bedroom? Is that in the bedroom? <laughs> Nibiru. Nah, that's gonna be a reflection. This is it right here. Looks like it would have eclipsed the whole thing, but it didn't. Just a little bit. Yeah, man. Shooting in 4K. Oh well. A little bit longer. We're almost done. Four K is killing my recording capacity. 
I don't know if I'll be able to make it to the end doing, you know, one minute shots of this. We'll try though. And that's about it. See you on the next one.